Hey guys, it's me. I'm back with another um, video. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to wipe these washes off of my hands. Okay, so I went to CVS to look for the new L'Oreal Infallible Face Setting Spray. I believe that's the correct name. And I saw it, but then I saw something better. So I said, okay, I can wait on a face setting spray because I'm not really wearing full face foundation and I have a lot of setting sprays. Let me get the other items that I found that was more of my eyes. Okay, so I, did, I gotta break down my phone because I don't want to mess up the name. Okay, so what I found were the new Maybelline Color Sensational Rebel Bloom Collection Lipstick. And they come in this pretty pink packaging. And if you notice on the side, it just says new. So I believe these will be part of the permanent 2015 Maybelline collection because nowhere on the display, nowhere on the packaging did it say limited edition. And we know, oh, well, yeah, I guess I can say we know watching my videos. I do love Maybelline Color Sensational. And when they are limited edition, they do say limited edition on the packaging. Let me grab one. See if I can find that little bit of different shoes. One thing I did with my one. Okay, found one. See, it says it right there at the top. Somewhere along that line, it will show you that it's limited edition. Nowhere on the packaging, nowhere on the display did it say limited edition. So, if you are on social media a lot, you see that L'Oreal, Maybelline have so many new products coming out. They even have the Femi Foundation, y'all, and I think it's matte or dewy. They have a new finish with that, and I'm very, I did see that display as well, but I guess because they're, it's just something they're introducing, they didn't have the whole color range, so none of the, I think it's about five shades, none of them. I knew were going to work for me, so it's like, okay, I'll wait till it's added to the regular wall with the Maybelline regular products, and then I'll see what the shade range, um, the complete shade range looks like. So, enough rambling, because it's probably going to be an hour video if I keep talking. Um, I'm going to just give you swatches and names of the lipstick, and I'm going to do them in chronological order, and there are 10 shades. They did resell for $8.99 at um, CVS, and no, they were not on sale. Yeah, so let's go ahead and get started. The first one, oh, let me just show you the packaging. It's this, again, it's this pretty pink, like, I can see this collection coming out in the springtime. Like, the edges, the display just spring, spring. But I guess that doesn't matter if it's going to be part of the permanent collection, so. This first one is in number 700 and barely bloomed. And it's a pretty new color. I hope my lighting is not so bad that so y'all can't uh, see it. Okay, this one. Hmm. Not feeling this pigmentation on this one. It's that new color right there. It seems like it didn't want to swatch. But it's, it is some exciting colors in here. And you know they blessed us with a purplish tone color because they know how we go crazy about purple. The next one is in 705 and Blushing Bud. This is pretty. It's a pinky um, mauve color. That one is pretty. This right there. I don't know if y'all can see. If not, please forgive me. I do plan on working on lighting and everything. I'm still adjusting my setup, still rearranging and some more stuff. This next one is in 710 and Petal Pink. This looks like something they have already out. With the with other collections or maybe something with the um another number for the different color. So that's it right there, the third color. So, so far, uh, I'm not going to say these, the first three are unique, but 
second fifteen in Hickaviff Pop. It's another kind of like a Barbie thing. And that's it right there. So you can tell the difference between the two paints right there. And the fifth one is in Power Peony and 720 Peony. I don't, I don't know. Y'all correct me. I know it's the name of a flower. But I see this collection has a lot of pinks in it. With the have panches and the last four are pink. But that's it right there. Looks very similar to that on camera, but it's different. I actually like this one the best. Next one is a 725 Lilac Flush, and it's a pretty lilac purple. I do like this color a lot. Very pretty. That's very pretty. I do like that color a lot. Next one is 7.30 in Orchid Ecstasy. Oh my god, yeah. I'm trying to tell you they right here. This color and the one I just watched, which was, which was it again? The Lilac Flush. So far, um, definite massage. And these all have a cream finish that I can so they have like a slight shine to them. Next one is in 735 Rose Rush. It's it's a reddish I don't know, like a tomatoish reddish orange I would say. The next one is a 740 Coral Burst. Burst. I'm sorry. Coral Burst. Yeah. Finally got it out. And that's it right there. That one is nice too. Nice coral. Right there. And last but not least is 745 and Peach Coffee. So this is maybe it's like a milky peach color. I hope y'all can see these colors. That's pretty. Right there. So yeah. It's kind of, I mean I would say at least half of these in my opinion for me would be a massage if I could do it. If I would have just went through and picked the colors I want, probably would have just got half of them, but to me being sort of a blog, I want to come through and show y'all all of them and give you swatches, so that's why I tend to um, get a whole collection of something when I find it, so I can kind of swatch and review it and show you guys um, the whole range of whatever collection it is. So, those are the colors. The smell is not bad. Because I know sometimes with um, some of um, Maybelline's um, color sensation lipsticks, they will have that chemical type of smell. But this is just a traditional smell. It's not overpowering and it's, it's subtle. It's not something that will bother you if you're sensitive to smell. But I know like some of the limited edition ones had like, I don't know. It's just a bad smell, and it's like you can taste it. It was just not good at all. But glad to know that these are not like some of them. It's not all of them. Maybe it depends on the color and what the color, um, the ingredients that is in certain colors. I don't know. But if y'all know, let me know. But I get kind of iffy when um, the ones that have like that chemical smell just. 
something that doesn't fit right now. But yeah. One more time, please. I'm trying to get in under 10 minutes, but y'all know I love to talk. So that's it. So once again, let me look at my phone again because it's a long title and I don't want to mess it up. These are the new Maybelline Color Sensational Rebel Bloom Collection. <laughs> So I hope y'all could kind of see the swatches. Yeah, I'm I'm trying, y'all. And yeah, I hope y'all can see them. And yeah, just let me know what your girlies think. If you spotted them, if you have spotted them. And FYI, um, you know, like the table space is kind of like a preview of what they're gonna put in, you know, with the regular collection. So the display only holds two of each color. So I've only seen it at. Um, CVS and one time because I told you I was looking for something totally different and I haven't spotted it anywhere else yet so I don't know I'm sure it's going to be a Walgreens right in and all that good stuff but as of right now I can only say CVS and I did see them head back in the I should see the first spot to get all the new stuff but let me know if y'all spotted it, and let me know if there's some colors here that you probably are interested in getting, and I'll catch you girlies in the next video. Bye!